If you're just starting out with matplotlib, you might come across the subplot function a lot and ask yourself, why are we actually using it? So the point is, uh, I just had some examples here. So I imported NumPy, matplotlib, and got some bogus numbers to show you. So if you just want to draw one graph, the use of subplot is not as obvious to you. So you could just do, or you probably just did, plot x, y, let that run, and you got everything you need. So why to use subplot? Well, as so often, this is just a way to have a little bit more flexibility and is used as a standard way of doing things. But the full advantage gets clear if you want to create multiple graphs in one picture. So as an explanation, we will just draw a quick plot. Take fix and I will explain in a second what I did. Subplots one, two. Let that run. And there we go. So as we can see, it created one line with two different graphs in it. So basically what I did is I said I want one line with two columns. Okay. And basically, fig is the canvas we are drawing on. And I can just show you that by coloring the figure itself. Set. Let's do that in red. And as you can see, the background is all red. And that's what fig is. If you want to access the first one, we can just go AX1. And let's make that one blue. And as you can see, the first one is set to blue. And if we want to draw into it, we just go as we normally do. And there we go. And obviously, naturally, you can also set base color of the second one, yellow, and that's it. And now, for example, if you want to export this, you just save the figure and both graphs are saved. You could also do multiple rows, and this is accessed in a slightly different way, but it's basically the same. So we'll not type x1, x2, we'll just use xs, so axs, t, subplots, and let's make it two by two. And as you can see, it has uh, two rows and two columns. And the way to access this is we'll go with colors again. So this will be an array-like access. 0, 0, and let's say, nope. We'll set this to green. So we access the first one, so position 0, x, position 0, y, and we can just do that for all the others too. I'll just copy this. Let's take that one. Oh, whoops. And that one. two. So all yes. So we'll type blue here. Yellow. And red. And as you can see, they are colored just the way we wanted it. I hope this helped. See you next time.